Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, we'll cover how to organize things and track progress using projects. You can create new projects and manage existing ones from the projects page. Once you create a project, you'll be able to select it from the list on both the time tracker and timesheet. You can add the project to a time entry or log time on it in the timesheet. And then when you go to the reports, you'll see that all time entries for that project are grouped together. You can even color code projects to quickly see where the time goes. To add more hierarchy, you can use clients and tasks. Each project can belong to some client, so when you run a report, you can first group time by client and then subgroup by project. You can create clients in settings and assign them when creating a project. You can also assign clients to existing projects here, as well as create them on the fly like this. If you wish to track time only by client, you can create a project named after the client and never even bother with the client field. Or if you don't have clients in your company, you can change the label to something else in workspace settings like project type or category. If you wish to break down projects instead, you can use tasks. To create a task, open a project, type the task name and click add. Then, when you track time, you can select the task under its respective project. And when you open a report, you can group by project and subgroup by task, like this. If your projects follow a similar structure, you can use templates. For example, you can mark some project as a template, and when you want to create a new project, you can choose that template and that new project will have all the settings and tasks as the original templated project. In addition to the client project task hierarchy, you can use description and tag fields. The description field lets you describe what exactly you've worked on or simply add a note to that time entry. You can also use tags which work like keywords. For example, you can add an invoice tag to time entries in reports that you've charged for, or use them as a way to denote activity. They work across projects, so they're a great way to filter reports or group time entries. You can create tags beforehand in workspace settings or on the fly when tracking time. If you need to track more data, you can define your own custom fields. For example, you can create a field for project ID and expenses, and it will be available in the time tracker and timesheet for users to enter. Or even better, you can go to a project directly and define the project ID there, and all entries on that project will inherit the value. Then you can see the custom fields in reports filter by them and export to Excel and create advanced pivot tables like this. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out our other videos as well as like, share and subscribe.